Hi, my name is Mari Carmen, and I'm a graduate nursing student at the University of San Francisco. I will be receiving my master's degree with an emphasis in clinical nurse leadership. Oftentimes, I get asked by friends, family members, or colleagues, what is a CNL? So let me tell you what a CNL is, what he or she can contribute to our healthcare system, and its value. The CNL is a master's educated nurse prepared for practice across any healthcare setting. The CNL role was developed by the American Association of Colleges of Nursing in collaboration with leaders from healthcare practice and education to address the critical need to improve the quality of patient care outcomes. The CNL is a clinical leader at point of care who focuses on care coordination, outcomes measurement, transitions of care, interprofessional communication and team leadership, risk assessment, implementation of best practices based on evidence, and quality improvement. CNLs have a significant impact in healthcare, partly because CNLs look at things that bedside nurses are not afforded the time to look at. They step back and look at the patient holistically to see what's going on by analyzing if what is being done is the right thing for the patient. Furthermore, the CNL is an advanced generalist that works in the microsystem as a generalist. They can take on many roles as a leader, educator, and patient advocate, to name a few. CNLs are equipped to identify gaps in care. They can also research, develop, and implement a plan based on evidence-based practices to fill in those gaps. The CNL coordinates with the interdisciplinary team to implement plans of improvement and then reassesses to see if the processes improve outcomes and fills in those gaps. Overall, the CNL is essential for improving our healthcare system. And though it's a fairly new role in nursing, it has a great potential to improve patient care across all healthcare systems. So next time they ask you what a CNL is, you know now.